Okay, I want to say something about the Alec Baldwin situation with the single action revolver they was using in the film. Even though this is a little twenty two, this has the exact same type of action. The only difference is this thing has a safety on it. Which I'm putting the safety on. Uh, the weapon is clear, but just to show you how to make sure this is clear, of course we have it pointed in the same direction. Go to half cock, which releases the cylinder, the spin. Open the loading gate, and we just spin the cylinder. As you can see, each chamber is empty. And if there is something in the chamber, you have this little doodad right here. This is the ejection rod. If there is something in the chamber, you press into that, and it knocks whatever is in there out, knocks the shell out, or it's been casing, whatever. Okay, so we know this is clear. Now, he was claiming that he had pulled back the hammer and it just let go and fire. Okay, this is a single action revolver. The only way the hammer is going to go forward is if you press the trigger. Even on half cock, you have to pull back and use the, use the trigger to let, lower the hammer. Even if I swipe it back, my finger is off the trigger. Hammer is not going forward. Now, you've seen on some of the old cowboy, sh cowboy shows or westerns or whatever, when they fan the revolver, when they're doing boom, boom, boom real fast. Well, the only way you can do that is to keep your finger on the trigger. See how that hammer just falls forward? Now, if I take my finger off the trigger, no pressure on it. This is what happens when you cock the hammer. It doesn't just drop forward. So, so much for the claim of him not pulling the trigger. Just saying.